Hi guys, what is up and welcome back for another Mob Battle Mondays on the channel. And today we have the Undergarden going up against the Abyss Chapter 2. These are two recent mods I've reviewed and I'm very excited to see these battling and I know a lot of you are as well. That's why I couldn't pick a single suggestion today because or like one individual suggestion today because a lot had like various like use the undergarden against this or use the abyss chapter two against this so i thought why don't i put those sort of two together um because i really want to see what the mob bosses from each of them can do so i'm super hyped for this today if you are new to the channel though guys make sure to subscribe hit that notification bell then slap that like button you know what to do Alrighty, let's get on with it shall we so we have the masticator going up against well he's from the Undergarden mod going up against the Abyss Chapter 2 mobs. First up, we have the Soul Guard, a level 4. We have an Ice Knight. We have a level 4 Abyss Forest Zombie. We have a Protect Guard. We have an Abyss Wolf. And we have the Rocker at the end. I'm actually going to swap some of these around. I'm I feel like that's a bit of a better order. Um, Actually, no, we're going to do the wolf first, because I reckon he's probably going to be the weakest. All right, let's do this, shall we? So I don't think you will burn in this sort of daylight. No, you won't. <laughs> he looks mean and ready to go. Personally, I would not want to mess with this guy. Look at Needs to train legs, though. Somebody skips the leg day. Okay. Masticator, ready? Go up against the Abyss Wolf. Level 2. Only a level 2 wolf. And wowzers. Okay, did that, did, did, did that guy just, like, regen? So maybe I'll have, like, two in here. Just to see what that... Oh, my goodness. Do not tell me this guy has some mad regen on him. I think he flipping does. Okay, so if he has this amount of mad regen, the, the, the mobs are going to be in trouble. I can already sense this is going to be good. Is he, is he levitating? Does he walk on his hands? Have I just only noticed that? No wonder he doesn't need his legs. He uses his massive arms to move. It's kind of like Joe from Family Guy sort of vibe going on. Okay, so Soul Guard, level 4, do your ting, bro. Okay, it's, it is on. It is on. He is throwing shapes. He is, he's, he's doing very well, actually. He's doing very well against this guy. Uh, okay, he's sort of slowed down. I don't really know why. He's, he was doing fantastic. Okay, death. Um, what, where's the masticator's health at? So, it went down about half health. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say half. Um, wow, okay. So, the protector... Or the yeah the soul guard level four did very well I must say quite surprised by that quite surprised by that indeed okay but still the masticator won it let's go on with the next one we have an ice knight 50 HP I'm loving that I'm not having to use the mob sport mob battle stick today uh, really oh my gosh maybe I will use it just to make sure that these mobs are attacking. Uh, okay, so you have been hit and you have been hit. Okay, yep, definitely, definitely both hit this time. Uh, oh, oh, wow, wow, they do some mad damage. The Abyss Chapter 2 mobs do some mad damage. Flipping heck. But you do have some mad regen, bro. It's like a weird, like, breathing, walking, hammerhead shark thing. It's creepy, very creepy. Okay, let's try a level 4 zombie now. So this guy has 45 HP and has very, very good defense. But my, look at that damage. Look at that damage he's thrown off of him. My word, the masticator is having a... No way! Has the zombie level 4 been able to do this? Flipping heck. Wow, it was close though. He only had about three hits left in him and he would have been a goner. But my word, the, that guy did it. Only went and flipping did it. So let's try him up against the protect guard next. Um, wowzers, who, who would have thought the zombie would have done it? Yeah, this guy, that guy did. 
Uh, <laughs> that guy's very dead. Alright, let's try him up against the Roca. Now, I mean, this is one of the bosses from the mod. Not the strongest boss, but he's still pretty gosh damn strong. And I'm pretty sure he's going to get absolutely obliterated by this guy. I don't know. The Masticator is doing more damage to him than to previous mobs. But there you go. Let's see how many. Wow. Wow, he did take him down quite a lot. But let's see how many Masticators, Masticators, it takes to take down the main, main boss of this mod. So now we know that this guy, he can't survive against the main bosses in this mod. Not even a level 4 zombie, to be fair, actually. So we're going to have to use these guys for mob bosses or like a, the main mob next time. So that's going to be flipping awesome. So we have this guy. The Roca End Boss, and he is pretty much just a bigger version of what you just saw. Alright, so let's get five up in here. I think it's one five. Yeah, spot five up in here. Okay, no, don't fight each other. No, no infighting. Okay, that guy is, is, is really powering through them. So guys, you, you two really got to stop fight wowzers. Okay, he's, he's really, really wrecking them. Um, my goodness me. Too bad those two are fighting each other. Okay, I have no idea what has just happened to my screen. Did, did the, okay, okay, so the, the mob boss has done that. I was like, no, what the hell has happened? Um, thanks, thanks bro for that. Did you not know we were recording? This is a, this is a mob battle, wow. Okay, so, <laughs> barely, barely lost the third of his health. Uh, so that only means one thing. We'll kill him and spawn in a load more. And we'll see how many it does take. So let's just go for 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 20. I feel like that's an ample amount. Uh, didn't mean to take a screenshot. So they're all fighting. They're really not fighting him at all, are they? Uh, they're, they're sort of more interested in killing each other. Brutes. They are brutes. They don't care about anything. Uh, yeah, he's sort of just chilling in the middle, really. He's, he's vibing by himself. He's, no one really cares. No one's really going for him, which is a bit of a letdown, I've got to say. Um, okay, now one. Just a singular dude is fighting. You guys, let down. Big letdowns. Come on, stop killing each other. Come on. This, this is this is literally not what you were spawned in here for. Uh, you've done worse than the previous round. Okay, so go go for him. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Maybe I've got to, got to take it a bit. What the heck? That is a move. Dude just did a mad move on him. Okay. So, guys, stop fighting each other. Literally. Like, we, we've already been over this. It solves nothing. Like, just team. You're a team. No, no, no. They're still, they're still fighting each other on fire. They are, they're dying. They're idiots. This is, is literally running away. I feel like he's laughing at them, if anything. So I don't know what that fire ability was, but it was a mad one. So, I, I, I mean, guys, please give me suggestions for what you want this beast of a mob to go up against in the 1.16.4 Forge universe. He is a beast. Very, very strong mob. I'm trying to think of some other strong mobs that we have that we, we really need to put him up against. None are coming. Ooh, maybe the Hydra. Maybe the Hydra from the Ice and Fire mod. Maybe. That'd be interesting. Especially because he's got a fire ability. He might be able to take him down. But guys, let me know in the comment section down below what you think would be a good mob battle for this guy. And guys, as always, thank you so much for watching today's mob battle. Remember, if you are new to the channel or you've been a long time viewer and you just haven't subscribed yet, please make sure you do subscribe. Hit that like button, notification bell, because you don't want to miss any videos, guys. And yeah, till next time, see ya.